Daughter of former Saudi official says Kingdom attempted to lure her to consulate in Istanbul. This post received a score of 35,000, with an upvote ratio of 93%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Definitely stay away from Saudi consulates. Especially the one in Istanbul. I bet the Turks were already watching everything in real-time HD just waiting for the Saudis to fuck up once again. Turks had freaking audio monitoring in the room where that journalist was butchered. They definitely knew what's up. The guy doing the butchering was wearing an Apple Watch. Ah thanks. So they were able to listen in through the watch microphone? Yeah it was bugged somehow. Spy shit. Spy shit plus diplomatic immunity equals nothing done cool. Pretty much. It's why consulates and embassy staff are very often used for espionage. The flip side of that is that anyone who works for the embassy is basically waking around with a I'm a spy sign on their head so they perfect targets for espionage as well. Also everyone, including allies, spies on each other. You might have to partake in espionage and keep secrets is probably on the papers you sign when you accept employment lol. Greater than her father Saad Algebrai is currently waging a civil lawsuit in Washington, D.C., alleging that Bin Salman, also known as MBS, sent a hit team to target him in Canada where he and his daughter live in exile, and that the men involved were intercepted and deported by authorities at Ottawa's international airport. What? They don't detain hit men anymore. Isn't that like waving around a big, white, billboard-sized sign that says, try again, in bold, black letters? They probably had diplomatic immunity, so the worst thing they could do was to send them away. Diplomatic immunity is a privilege that should be revoked for nations that abuse it. So is having an embassy. If international politics was that easy the world would be a nice place. The harsh reality is that Saudi Arabia is a strategic ally of the US, and by extension the West, and therefore they can get away with stuff like that. I know they are an ally, but why do we care about their oil anymore? I thought last five-tenths of a year US was self-producing a lot. Are we worried about oil prices, which they can certainly affect, or maybe something to do with the dollar? Greater than or maybe something to do with the dollar. Maybe the petrodollar which helps keep demand for the dollar. I would guess that's the biggest aspect. US doesn't want OPEC to consider changing to the petro UN, etc. Iraq switched to trading in euros in 2000. Then they got liberated and now they trade in USD again. Gaddafi was planning a gold-backed currency to exchange for his oil. He also got liberated shortly afterwards. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.